This program is brought to you by Sirius Texas Barbecue. We take our meat seriously. You're watching Durango TV News. I'm Debbie Rhoda, sitting in for Wendy Graham Settle. I'm wearing my chef's jacket today in celebration of the return of the Pro Start Culinary Arts Program at Durango High School. After a six year hiatus, it's back and Pro Start students enjoyed their first coming out party when they prepared and served dinner to more than 70 business and community leaders earlier this month in the Durango High School cafeteria. Durango Superintendent Dan Snowberger hosted the community gathering to introduce the high school's career and technical education programs and to lay the groundwork for a ballot initiative to address maintenance and safety issues in the district. Six years ago, budget cuts forced the district to eliminate the Pro Start and Culinary Arts programs. The program remained dormant for the next five years because the district couldn't find a certified teacher with the appropriate family and consumer sciences credentials. But last year, the district founder in Jessica Bright, a certified teacher self -taught, and a self-taught foodie with 15 years of experience in marketing, food product development, and corporate event planning. Bright just started with the basics of food and nutrition classes offered through the Department of Family and Consumer Sciences at Durango High School. She introduced ProStart with the help of a $3,000 grant from the Durango Restaurant Association. And if students complete the two-year program, including a 400-hour food industry internship, they can earn college credit or ProStart certification to land a job after graduation. It teaches kids not only the technical skills of cooking a variety of techniques, but also the management side of what does it mean to be front of house, back of house, how to have customer service. Um, those basic life skills that students get is really part of the Pro Start curriculum. Bright said the Durango Restaurant Association has been key to Pro Start success by providing internships and financial support. This year, she is using the association's $3,000 grant to repair long dormant kitchen appliances and to replace missing equipment like pots, pans, utensils, flatware, and, dishes, and even dishes. Case in point, the dinner earlier this month had to be served on plastic plates. Nevertheless, first year Pro Start students showed off their skills with a menu of roast pork tenderloin topped with an herb sauce, Parmesan and garlic orzo, grilled vegetables, and cheesecake with a berry compote on top. Although ProStart is geared towards students who may want to work in the food industry, Wright says it can benefit any student who wants to learn how to cook for themselves. It's very different now. Kids are being responsible, they're more responsible for having to cook their own meals and fend for themselves or siblings. So what this program kind of allows and what I'm seeing is just more people need to learn the basic skills. And without a class like this, where are you gonna learn how to do that? Um, so the, there's just that passion that the students bring and wanting to learn is something that I've seen in the industry. And if you don't know this about the Durango, we have more restaurants per capita than the city of San Francisco. This is a huge industry for our town. And in Durango specifically, having the students with those skills greatly impacts our just economic footprint across the board of what we can do in this town. For students like Embry Seville, the Pro Start program has allowed her to indulge in her passion, cooking and baking for others. It has taught a lot, especially like I want to go into the baking industry, so I want to be a pastry chef. And I've learned a lot about uh, just different, ton of different baking techniques and uh, procedures. If you'd like to know more about the Pro Start program or make a donation, visit Durango High School's webpage at dhs.durangoschools.org. I'm Deborah Uroda with Durango TV News. Thanks for watching and bon appetit.